Hello, uh, this is Matthew Robert Klein, and uh, I'm just drinking my lemon and honey drink. Uh, I've got a sore throat. It's been persisting for 10 weeks, and I've just got to address it with my lemon and honey. The medication doesn't seem to be working. Um, so I've, I sense that uh, my sickness is like an analogy in your life. Um, first of all, I have to say that my first wife, name was Sharon. It's a very special uh, name to me. Um, but I sense uh, my sickness has been like an analogy. Uh, it's just going on and on and it's not stopping. <coughs> Same uh, feel the same as uh, true uh, for your life that uh, you've had uh, hard things and trials. <coughs> <coughs> the struggles uh, persist and go on and on uh, with your life. And you're like me, and this sickness, uh, you don't blame God. And the trials and the struggles you've had, uh, you don't take issue with God. You don't uh, blame God. You understand that the enemy is uh, at work uh, giving you trials and hard times. And um, since as you've been through these hard times and trials, <coughs> Getting uh, closer and closer. <coughs> <coughs> to God, sorry about uh, this cough. So, since uh, you're learning more and more, um, one thing that happens uh, when you um, when you uh, go through trials and struggles. Uh, when a person uh, suffers uh, from these sort of things, uh, they can um, just wipe in my keyboard. Um, they can um, develop uh, tremendous ability uh, to have uh, compassion and um, a sense that um, uh, uh, you can. Um, uh, have uh, tremendous compassion uh, built up in you. Uh, normally people who have uh, only had trials and struggles had, uh, had a hard time uh, develop uh, compassion and consideration of uh, other people. And um, since it, uh, you've built this uh, capacity up in your own life, uh, and I feel that um, God is going to use you uh, in an amazing way to uh, counsel people and coach people and uh, minister to people. And um, since it's one of your desires <clears throat> to be used uh, to minister uh, both uh, emotional and spiritual healing and physical healing, and um, sense that it's on your destiny uh, scroll uh, to be a helper. Uh, I can also see um, you uh, operating and uh, being successful in business. I can also see you preaching and ministering, and be successful in preaching and ministering. I can also see you um, networking with people and networking with uh, different people in ministries, connecting people in business and in ministry. Um, I'm used to doing uh, prophetic uh, blueprint scrolls and uh, some of that uh, new gifting and new uh, understandings coming through. Um, I encourage you to order a blueprint uh, where I can go into nine things about your future, what your destiny is. But I, I really encourage you uh, to persist and uh, to continue. And like uh, when you've suffered, like same as when I have this cough, You've really got no choice 
uh, you're, um, you're stuck with this life. You're stuck with what you go through. Uh, you can't uh, go backwards and see uh, the world and go back into the world and have trials and struggles in the world. You've got to persist and pursue uh, Jesus. And uh, although it's hard and though it's tough, uh, though it's uh, hard to understand, you've got to uh, persist and pursue. And uh, I sense that uh, the Lord uh, really wants to encourage you. <coughs> <coughs> sense that Jesus... <coughs> really wants to uh, bless you and tell you that uh, you're special, that you're a delight for him and uh, the reason why you've got this so much attack and trials is because you're a threat to Satan. Um, he thinks that um, if he threatens you and annoys you enough, you'll quit the fight, you know, you'll quit the race and um, you know that um, yourself, that you're resilient and uh, that uh, you've got endurance and patience and you've heard the promises of your life and uh, the promises of better days and the promise of uh, surviving. So uh, quitting is not an option for you, but um, the enemy is driving it home and pushing it all the time and trying to uh, destruct you and uh, trying to take you out. I'd be very interested in uh, speaking to you on Zoom on the app video conferencing, I'd be interested in having a chat about life and about situations and about uh, who you are um, because um, I'd love to uh, have a chat about how you've suffered and the trials you've been through and uh, your aspirations and your dreams and, um, and uh, the prophecies, the big prophecies that have been over your life. I'd love to uh, hear them and discuss them and uh, meet face to face and um, consider them because I, uh, all I sense is you've got this huge potential and you're a real threat uh, to the enemy and um, he's pulling out all the stops and doing everything he can to distract you and pull you down and uh, uh, shift you off uh, your uh, potential and shift you off uh, who you're meant to be and um, so I sense that, um, that uh, that's what he wants to do and that's his agenda. <coughs> <coughs> and uh, he just doesn't want to give up and uh, he uh, doesn't want to back off. And uh, I sense that um, you're more resilient than that and uh, you cop the abuse and cop the attack and cop the trial as long as it has to go on, uh, you're going to persist. Uh, you've heard the promises of God. You know who you are. You know, you know who you're capable of uh, serving. And, um, and uh, you just know uh, who you're meant to be. You know your future. And uh, you're just not going to back down. You will not back down. And uh, he needs to take his warfare and his troubles somewhere else and concentrate on someone else because he's going to get beaten all around the head and you're going to kick balls out of the park, smash balls out of the park. You're going to do great and mighty and uh, amazing things uh, with your life and uh, with everything that you do. So I just pray that the favour of God and the presence and the peace of God may start to manifest in your life, that doors would open, that things would shift, that, uh, that you'd feel... Uh, the definite favour of God that everything you turn your hand to, everything uh, that you decide to do would shift and uh, be a blessing and uh, I pray <coughs> <coughs> the favour of God that's over my life. I pray that over your life. Um, God bless. I hope that uh, you can give me feedback. If you're watching this on YouTube, I encourage you to go to the description tag and Order your own. God bless.